I am here at a book signing for Bringing Forth the Dreamer and You. Get your copy today. <laughs> They're only designed to keep you from They just want to intimidate you. Pastor Rodney Davis. Bless you. How are you? I'm doing well. How are you? I am excited. Excited to be here. Amen. Talk to us about your chapter in the book of Bringing Forth the Dreamer in You. Well, my chapter is called Qualifying the Dream. Um, one of those things is, is does it scare you? You know, many people are intimidated by their dream. Well, that's God from God. That's a God-sized dream. So you want, to, you want to think about that. And I talk about a lot of things in qualifying the dream, but one of the big things I talk about is opposition. That anytime you're going to pursue your dream and go for your purpose and do something significant and important, you're going to face opposition. You're going to face giants. But, but there's a, a key. Uh, 1 Corinthians 16, 9, it says this, A great and effectual door has been opened unto you. And there are many adversaries. In other words, how you know you're headed in the right direction is by the adversary, the hater that you see ahead. Mm -hmm. But the, the thing is, the hater is only allowed to mess with you on something God has already established for you. He's already made it. It says a great and effectual door has been opened. The door is already open. Amen. And, and so the last thing I, I say is when you're facing that giant that's going to try to hinder you, understand something about the giant, that the giant is not designed to fight, but a giant is designed to keep you from fighting. Mm. On that note, <laughs> oh, that's good. Yeah. Oh, yes. that chapter sounds awesome. It's powerful. You need to get it. I'm telling you, that's just one point of many. Okay. Thank you so much for joining us on Living the Vision, Pastor David. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Very Amen. welcome. We appreciate Thank you. you.